Oh, thanks to Leon for the first four races of day two then. And I'll start my day two stint by going straight into the biggest race of the week. It's the mile and a half King George VI and Queen Elizabeth Diamond Stakes. Group one, of course, from Ascot. And at the top, we've got King's Hall for Leon van Rensburg. Own reflection, Craig Allen. Smashy, Joshua Sutherland. The Greg Gatsby, Dan Hughes. Time to shine, Craig Beck with double chest, Darren Thompson. Funny Sunny, David Hooley. Global sale for Craig Allen. Golden Clouds, Leon van Rensburg. Future treasure, Craig Beck with Iron Mike, Paul Rhodes. Storm Murmur, David Robertson. Barber Coast, Darren Thompson. Bella Brandy, Joshua Sutherland. Hopes and dreams for Drappy. All ins for Paul Rhodes. And Roaring Hawk for Dan Hughes. They're all in. And... Ready to go in the rain, then big field, one or two of those caught wide, might have a spot of bother. But they're away and racing, and King's Hall has got over to the fence, and is going to be the early leader from Iron Mike. And Storm Murmurs also up there as well, so two is all in, so Paul Rhodes has got two in the first four at the moment, and Iron Mike has now gone on to take it up from stable mate all leans. We have King's Hall on the inside in third, and chasing that one is Smashy with Bella Brandy tucked in behind so the two Sutherland, Joshua Sutherland horses are running together as well looking towards the back Hope and Dreams just about the back marker at this stage of the race so they're racing down the back part of the Ascot track then and they're racing down towards the final mile now with Iron Mike and all leans clear of Smashy in third Kings Hall in fourth wide on the track Funny Sunny is trying to get going double chests also quite wide so to Storm Murmur and Future Treasure oh it's really really wide looks like it might well be own reflection but it's still all leans and Iron Mike disputing the lead then with a good four length advantage over Smashy in third, Barber Coas has now come through with the runner moving into third place, being chased by a stable mate, double chest, and Future Treasures also now making a forward move wide on the outside, so to his global sale, and it's wide open this one, and Iron Mike and Orleans are clear of Barber Coas and double chest, and lots of these trainers who are double handed their horses running together, and it's Iron Mike and Orleans being chased by Global Sale now wide on the outside then comes Barbaco, Storm Murmur, Double Chest he's trying to get into it, King's Hall and Smashy got work to do on the inside so too is Bella Brandy, Funny Sunny needs to pick up soon as well, looking out the back the great Gatsby's not on a going day today but it's Iron Mike in the lead from all ends in second, Barbaco is in third they're inside the final three, now the Van Rensburg pair, King Hall and Golden Clouds start to run on together, Global Sale's wide of them, chasing them, Storm Murmur Smashy and Bella Brandy, but it's Iron Mike who's clear two furlongs to go and Iron Mike clearing the front but now being very quickly caught by the pack as Iron Mike now hits the wall he's been challenged by Barbacoas Barbacoas has gone on Golden Clouds Global Sale King's Hall trying to get back into it but it's Barbacoas in front from Golden Clouds and Queen on the final half furlong is Barbacoas and Golden Clouds and Golden Clouds hits the front of the King George and Golden Clouds from Stablemate King's Hall it's a 1-2 for Leon as Golden Clouds takes it King's Hall second double chest round to be third and one or two of those never got into it at all. And Hopes and Dreams was hopelessly tailed off at the back. But it's Golden Clouds for Leon Van Rensburg, the winner. King's Hall for the same trainer was second. Double Chest, Darren Thompson, third. Bella Brandy for Joshua Sutherland, fourth. And Barbara Coas for Darren Thompson was fifth.